Let's continue Yakuza 5 if you're watching this later on YouTube. Thanks for clicking. Have you been enjoying so far? Let's find out what this bear plot is about. I'm still convinced that this is uh, a real bear. <laughs> I had a dream about it. I, I talked about it earlier, but I'll just say that I was playing the game and it ended up being the mystical old man being the bear. So, um, give me a sec. Side stories? No, hang on. How does this work? I don't know how to look at side stories. Um... Well, I guess we're gonna... Shoot Yama Oroshi with a transmitter, so we're doing that now. Yeah, all set. Fine, get your gear sorted. Okay, uh... So let's take cold weather rations. A couple of these. I sold everything else, I think. Okay. Remember, you're going up against Yama Oroshi. All I can say is try not to die. Good advice. Alright. I'll find you, Yama Oroshi. Just gotta, well, search everywhere, I guess. Okay. Health seems good. I probably should have sat and healed. It's okay. Whoa, what is camera? Whoa! That was weird. It wasn't following me for a sec. Again, if you don't like hunting, avert your eyes <laughs> for just a sec. set up a different one. This one hasn't got anything either, but I'll leave it. Okay, that one's got a catch. It's just so I have income when I get back to the city. Such a bad shot. <laughs> Stop moving. There we go. <laughs> I have to do this because I'll I'll get meat that'll keep me alive on the mountain. Oh, and there's already a trap here. I guess I've already loaded these ones. Edge trap. 
this. Um, I mean, I'll send the skin back. It's not really necessary to hang on to. Okay, um... I'll eat some of the vegetables I found. Sneaky, sneaky. So how do I know? It looks like it was just here. It might still be Roman close by. I'll see if he shows his face at the spot. I guess, how do I know if I'm shooting him with a tranquilizer? Hmm. Said shoot him in the belly, so... He's coming. Oh, shit. Slim chance of him showing his belly if I sit here doing nothing. Maybe if I shoot him a few times, he'll get mad and rear up. Okay. At that point, uh, I'll have to be quick to nail him in the belly. Alright, here goes. Okay, hold on. I'm going to make sure that I have eaten. Just make sure. Oh, I should probably step back a little. <laughs> Longest reload of my life. Oh, this is annoying. You're up. <laughs> Got him. Time to get out of here. Alright, good. Map. Show the map, 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 show the map. Show the map! It didn't want to show the map. That dialogue box just wouldn't go away. Okay, well he's not chasing me, so that's good news. Whoa! <laughs> what the hell? He teleported down the mountain? Oh no, this is 100% like a mystical bear. There is no way that... This is a normal bear. Now I will be able to see exactly where Yama Oroshi is. Can't wait to see the grin on Okudera Han's face when I tell him. You're alive, that's a surprise. What happened? Plugged him squarely. From now on, we'll know where Yama Oroshi is. That's great news. Rest up. I asked a lot of you. Won't argue with you. Okay. Oh, 
unsteadiness while shooting is reduced. Nice. When you're ready, we'll search for Yama Oroshi's den. You're feeling up to it already. I may not be able to hold the gun, but I've got you. If you're willing to help an old man get around, that is. Ha. Huh. You're putting a lot of faith in me. So no worries, old man. I got your back. Da, I'll start packing. Just tell me when you're ready. Got it. Okay. Um. I'm definitely gonna sit here for a minute. And just let the health increase. I'll save as well. I've just been saving after every mission. So I'm not sure what happens if you lose. I don't want to find out. I do think it's dumb that you have to wait, but it is what it is. Um. Maybe, hang on, Yakuza 5, Mountain, God, Offerings. So, some meat from a small animal. Oh, that's easy. Deer meat. Something gorgeous. Gold plate. A pin up mat. Oh, well, see, some of this I guess you do later. Some of it I can do now. But it looks like you can come back. I just got unlucky with the offering, I guess. Um, excellent, I have both. I have fox meat, which is small, and deer meat, which is larger. So I can do... The deer meat, I, don't, I could probably get away with doing one more. Because I don't have heal items. Guess I would use this as a heal source to try and force my way through it. Okay, let's try it. Interact with the shrine. There it is. Hey! Why is that in my inventory? Hang on. It doesn't let me. Why is that? It should. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it means Martin meat, which I guess I don't have. Or oh, rabbit. Fox skin. Okay. Well, that's easy. Like, maybe he's just straight up selling meat. Nah. Okay. I do think this is a little clunky that you have to... ...kind of go back between the two inventories. I got lost for a sec. <laughs> Oh, 
put this away for now. Fox skin. That's all I need, right? Yeah. And I'll keep the meats for now. I'll have to keep in mind to save the Martin meat if I catch another. Or a rabbit, whichever one comes first. Eh? Fox skin. Go ahead, take it. Thank you. This is a huge boon for my business. I really appreciate you helping me out. The customer should be happy now. Gotta keep your customers happy. So, okay. So, uh, it's actually not too hard to do this. Okay, next mission. Search for the den. Are you ready? Yeah, all set. Fine, get your gear sorted. Uh, equipment. And I'll bring these again, and rations. Alright. Let's go. I can't hold the gun yet, so I'm counting on you. I know. Where's the fake signal coming from now? Pretty damn deep in the woods. It's somewhere I've been before, though. The distance is no matter to me. Let's follow it. Just keep checking that we're on the right track as we go. Will do. Seems like there's more snow now. I might be imagining it. Oh, crap. Ooh, this is way more steady. I think I set up a trap down this way that... wait. Down this way. That I haven't checked on. Oh, 
careful, even if I haven't. Good for business. Okay. I think this is the trap I was thinking of coming around the corner now. Yeah, it hasn't caught anything. Oh shit. I didn't reload. Like an idiot. Jagunik Kyoshukuye. Baru Omoinaya. Okay, good, that's a small one. I'm surprised the traps haven't broken. That was supposed to be a thing. And it hasn't happened yet. Okay, now I got, I got it. Now we've got the small animal. Oh shit, it's actually here. It's just more deal. Ah, oh, turn just at the last second. There we go. Got it. Well, this is a good day. Um, yeah, let's send that back. Oh no, Okudurahan. He's on the move. Let's head him off. Oh shit, did I get rid of... Oh no, it's okay. Camera, please. Oh wow, that, no, the bear bile actually heals quite a bit. I could totally do these fights off the bear bile alone. I can 
actually shoot this. It's probably not worth the effort. <laughs> it's not worth the effort. Let's just keep going. But it's more money. He's on the move again. This way, Okadera Han. Okay, the other way. Could have probably repaired all these huts, but eh. let's just make sure we are reloaded. Is he actually here? This feels like a den. Okay. We're getting close. He's still moving away from us, but we're closing the gap for sure. Good. Let's keep up the chase. I love how Okudera is not really freezing at all. His health is not dropping in the slightest. He's right up ahead. Hasn't moved for a while. He's staying still? That means he could be in his den. Let's hurry. Another bear. Uh-oh. Problem. There. Okay, got it. Um, this is fine because I'll get a replacement one. Oh, it's like a full heal. Okay. Oh, it's going to be the bridge and we can't cross the bridge. This is going to be a dead end. This makes sense now. Yama Roshi is on the other side of this canyon. But how? The bridge is shredded worse than cheese that's about to go on spaghetti. Ah. <sighs> The signal's just on the other side? Yeah. Then we can't go any further today. Figured. 
Damn it. Oh, this bear is, is mystical. It has to be. Hmm. The other side of the canyon. Well, now that we know the location of its den, there'll be plenty of other opportunities. Okuderahan backed off so quickly. It's not like him. I'll cook supper, Saejima. Why don't you go see how the village is faring? Sure, that's something to do. Well, now that I know this is like a major heal, I feel more confident in it. Rabbit meat. Deer meat. I save <laughs> so I don't lose progress. I worry I'm just gonna brick this at some point. Okay. There we go. Uh, rabbit meat. Wrong offering. Nah. Guess I hit the mark. So you are the one who mocks the god of the mountain? How many of these guys are there? I am Hamura, first and foremost among the mountain god clan. Does that make you the dad then? That I am, and you have denigrated my sons. I ain't done nothing like that. Your words ring false, for it is the nature of mortals to lie. If you don't believe a word I say, then I don't know why we're even talking. Claim to seek power. I shall show you what true power is. Then you will know the folly of your ways. Oh boy. Oh. Gonna be on my guard this time. Ugh, damn it. Okay, this one's not too bad. Ugh, just gotta time it. Invasive, isn't he? Oh, that's easy. I forgot, like, the backhand is a thing now. Oh, 
can't follow up. Nearly there. Do the thing. He's not doing the thing anymore. There you go. Patient. There we go. You okay, old man? Grabs? You're not dead, are you? Eh. Uh, no, I'm still here. Ain't this training a little too hard on you? You mean being pummeled by an ox of a man like you? The answer is a definitive yes. Uh. Yeah, sorry about that. No, it's quite alright. Now tell me what the gods bestowed upon you this time. Let me see, uh. Tiger essence of braining? Hmm, I too sense something growing within me. Albeit slowly. Something growing within you? Like, what? Can't say for sure. But I do believe it's a step toward the greater truth. Well, I don't know much about these mountain gods of yours, but they seem pretty pissed off. The wrath of the mountain gods is the wrath of nature. A message for us mortals. You mean like... Better take care of the environment, stuff like that. Just so... Well, Tanjima, I do hope you stop by again. I will, I'm just going to go heal first. A mighty, a slightly bigger animal, so it's the deer. Alright. So let me save and heal up. And then hopefully I can fight without healing. That went alright. Just sucks that I can't use heat actions against that thing. <laughs> Well, now we wait. What else have I got? Mm, nothing, really. I mean, this is cool how it's teaching him new abilities. A, a ridiculous plot. <laughs> I still think that this whole bear thing is just going to end in a weird direction. Anyway, sorry I have to sit here and do nothing, but I couldn't find a way to just heal. Like, I tried saving, and it just doesn't heal when you save. I feel like that's a bit of an oversight. To not just have an easy, easy heal. Nearly done. I'm gonna need all the health I can get with this. It's just, the dudes are tough. Come on. Just another 20 more seconds. I would imagine. Uh, 
That's done. Yeah, okay. Um... Rise hate guys by sucking self up. Deliver a devastating blow with a giant piece of equipment ripped out of the ground. Oh shit, that's kind of crazy. Lift up an enemy who bounced back from a wall and then ram him into a cannonball force. These abilities, man. Sidemar is definitely more leveled up than Kiryu now. All right. Dear me. Here it comes. No, I'm afraid it's merely my backside. It's itching something terrible. You picked one hell of a time to get an itchy ass, old man. Sorry. Ah! Enough already. If it itches that bad, I'll scratch it for you. Oh. Guess it's the real thing now. Let us dispense with the pleasantries. Now, prepare yourself. <laughs> Whoa, 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 slow down. Ain't you even gonna tell me your name? My name? Your ears are not worthy of hearing it. Huh, <laughs> this one sounds like a real asshole. The others were at least a little more sociable. Very well, my name is Tisaragi. So now you give me your name? What happened to the high and mighty bit? There is no need for such a tone. You shall find this encounter to your benefit, no doubt. Now a mountain god's trying to calm me down. Man, what next? If you would seek power, then prove that you can endure my ordeal. Why don't you just open with that instead of wasting both our time? There are a myriad of paths in this world. This is but one of them. Whatever you say, buddy. Now brace yourself. Okay. Oh, great. <laughs> but you can see him. That's fine. It's the same abilities, it's just now he's invisible. Grabbing him is a possibility. Get him in this corner. Don't let him move. This was fine. Thankfully has an identical moveset. I 
struck him for a sec. Be patient, one more hit. There we go. Ah. You there, old man? Did a mountain god possess me again? It was some smart ass named Sisaragi this time. His personality seemed a bit erratic, though. These gods are kind of half assed. Getting half assed. Nah, I believe it's simply a matter of each one having a distinct personality in accordance with the natural phenomenon over which it presides. But enough about that. What sort of power did you gain this time, Saejima? Hmm, let me see, uh... But the offering was a little different this time, and that conversation was weird. Can't help thinking there's something strange going on here. Don't be silly, Saejima. It's really quite simple. The gods are as fickle as mountain weather. I don't know about that, but whatever. Yes, well, I hope you'll visit again when you get a chance. Yeah, I'll do that. So the next one I can't do now. This can't go on. I have to get me some antlers. What's up? Nothing is up, thank you very much. Ugh, you just don't understand. Try me. Well, it has to do with my family harmony. I haven't been keeping up with the fam fami familial duty to my wife, if you know what I mean by keeping it up. Excuse me? Is he saying what I think he's saying? <laughs> I got the picture. So yeah, as a result, the old lady's feeling all kinds of neglected. Now she's given me the silent treatment. So, stop neglecting her. Is it my fault the old boy is not so frisky anymore? That's... a shame. Sure is, so... Uh, let me hit you up with a proposition. Deer antlers. Uh, what's the connection? You don't know? It's an age-old remedy for putting a little spring back into a man's step. It's not called a stag horn for nothing. You really believe that? That sounds like an old wives' tale. Well, I won't know for sure unless I try it. And seriously, I have to try something. Glad I don't have this problem. Great, then help another man out, would you? One antler is all I need if you find one. Pass it my way. Help make my home a happy place. God damn it. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I mean, it's on brand for this game. Dude can't get an erection, so we're gonna go kill a deer so he can get an erection. It's okay. I have one. I prepared already. Hunting is manly. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I don't know what he's gonna do with the antler. Is he gonna grind it into a powder and snort it? Is he gonna consume it? Like, what's he doing? Oh, hi. So, did you get the antler to make me a panther? Okay, where is this going? Here. Yeah. Have a good time with your wife. Ah, yes, this is it! You saved our marriage! They're not a moment too soon, it's going to be a long night! Here, yeah, take this in return. Alright, honey, here I come! Okay, then. No, no follow-up on it. That's just, yep. Dude's gone to do his thing. Huh? Oh, Sai 
島さん今回は随分長く山に入ってたねあんまりにも帰ってこないから遭難したかと思って心配したよ I was not expecting to help a dude with、um, erectile dysfunction gotta say that was not on the list <laughs> なんだと山おろしの隅っこを見つけただとまだ断定はできんそうやがまちがいないと奥寺はんが言うとったどこなんだそこはそれがかなり山の奥のそれ地図に書ききれんくらいの場所やそれで奥寺さんは今は家で
地理が合うんだ鮫島何や今はええ話は帰ってくれあ俺は俺は僕じゃない What is, what is this plot twist? <laughs> what? What do you mean you're not Okudera? I, I swear if this ends in the bear being a human, uh, I don't know how I'm gonna react. Like, where bear situation. なんとか一命は取り留めたというところか<笑>なあ西名藩桜井藩そろそろ本間の話 Are they finally gonna tell us what's going on? 何の話だ奥寺藩気を失う前に言うとった自分は奥寺やないとあんたらそのこと知っとったんじゃうが。西名さん、私が話しましょうか。いや、俺が話そう。一応。Everyone has like been avoiding this topic, so let's hear it. 教えてくれ。奥寺がお前に言った通りだ。奥寺は奥寺ではない。佐藤清というのは。Oh, he's the dude that's supposedly abandoned. The real Okudera? Or saved? That's right. But I think that's what it is. 彼の素性、どこから来た人間なのかも知らなかった。そうやったらなんでやったらその男のことを佐藤って呼んでるんや。あの男の名が佐藤だということを知ったのは、奥寺が警察に捜索願いを出した時だ。それまでは、奥寺の名前すら俺らは知らなかった。ほんならまさか、奥寺藩は。He swapped names, the hunter that went missing. That's what happened to the other guy. Ah, he's a prisoner, Scapy. アバシリから脱獄したらしい。なんやと。殺人罪で無期懲役の囚人の脱獄。ちょうど佐藤が奥寺を雪山で救出した時期と重なる。ほな、ほんまに奥寺藩は。真相はわからない。いや、それ以上探ろうとはしなかった。ああ、シェイ。その日以来、俺たち漁師は、奥寺との接触を避け続けた。心を通わせることで、彼の素性を知ってしまうことがないようにな。素性を知ってしまえば、彼を警察に突き出さなければならなくなってしまう。それが嫌だったんだ。それでわざと奥寺藩を村八部に。せけど。なんであんたらはそないな辛い思いをしてまで奥寺藩を守ったんやそれは彼が私たちを救ってくれた命の恩人だからだ、okay, this makes sense now. 9年前山下ろしにこの村は襲われただがあの原因を作ってしまったのは奥寺や佐藤じゃない本当はこの村に住む漁師全員のせいなんだよ
So he actually saved the village. So they're just doing it so they don't turn them in. Which I guess bodes well for this guy. It's like, well, he went to jail. And if he does some good, I guess his life is fine. Um, hold on. Before I do that, again, saving, but also I'm recovering my health because I'm afraid I'm going to have to fight the bear. <laughs> Or whatever the bear is, like, I don't know. It might just be what it, it really is, like, it's just a gigantic bear, but with these games, you just don't know. Okay, let's just wait, like, 20 seconds. I really wish there was a better way to heal, but... Ah! Who makes you wait? This is probably the most invested I've gotten in a side story in the series so far. Like, there was enough ambiguity that made me want to do this all the way to the end. Like, right away. <laughs> I mean, the dude with the deer antler. Part of me wants to know what exactly he was going to do with her, but another part is I'm kind of glad they didn't. Like, left that- just left it up to the imagination. What would be... a home remedy involving a deer antler? Okay. There we go. さえじまさん。ああ。ちょっと西野の親父さんに呼ばれてきたんやね。あの人なら桜井さんと一緒に裏の倉庫にいます。そうか。あの、さえじまさん。何や。実は今まで黙っていたんですが主人や桜井さん
ちょうど文化財保護法という法律が改定される直前でなこの山も法律で保護されることが決まっていたそうなれば食料確保と漁師の生活目的以外の狩猟は全て禁止当然クマやシカといった動物を思考目的で殺すことはできなくなるそこに目をつけたブローカーがこぞってこの周辺にハンターを送り込んだのさ希少価値の高い巨大グマやシカの剥製を法律改定前に手に入れるためになしかし冬の雪山はそんなに甘くない奴らの手配したハンターは次々と遭難死したそこで我々に目をつけたこの集落のマタギが買収されたってことかいい金になったそれまで I thought this was gonna be more more random like、oh, animatronic bear 夢のような仕事だった俺らは来る日も来る日も狩りを続けたよそうこの山の生態系のバランスを崩してしまうほどになまさかそれが原因で山おろしがああ本来クマは人など襲わないだがそうでもしないと動物たちも生きていけない環境を俺らが作り出してしまっていたんだ皮肉な話やなおそらく9年前行方不明になった佐藤という男はその噂を聞きつけてやってきた密漁目的の漁師だったんだろうそれでやつは一番金になるであろう山おろしに目をつけた一攫千金を狙ったちゅうわけかああだが奥寺は違った山おろしからこの集落を守るため命を懸けて戦ってくれたそして事件の後も黙々と漁師としての生活を続けることで俺たちに漁師としての原点を思い出させてくれた本当に奥寺さん<笑>そして今もまだ山おろしと一人戦ってくれている奥寺さんは俺たちを9年前の恐怖から救い出そうとしてくれているんだよきっとな西野なんだ何だ集落の方からだ行ってみよう。ドライシュタインでで出,出たんだ落ち着け何が出たんだ山おろしや山おろしがこのすぐ先の山中で何だとこ,こうしちゃいられねえすぐに家に帰って戸締まりしとかねえとまさかそんなにすぐ近くにいるとはな西野はんなんだ俺が行くなんだと実は俺もあんたらに黙ってたことがある俺も奥寺藩と同じ無所から抜け出てきた人間なんやえあんたが脱獄主あんたらを助ける代わりに見逃してほしいなんてことは言わんせやけど奥寺藩やあんたらにこれ以上、うん、9年前のことで苦しんでほしいないんや佐江島さんもし山おろしに俺がやられたらそん時は香坂藩って人に伝えてほしい俺が入っとった刑務所の副所長へ約束守れへんかったすまんかったと<笑>頼む俺に行かせてくれ分かっただが協力はできないちょちょっと西名さんどうして桜井さん事情はどうか、yeah, 真実を知ってしまった以上
犯罪者に力は貸せないそうでしょうしかし悪く思うなこれがこの集落を守る人間としてできる精一杯のことだ十分やありがとうな Might come across the armor of whatever. <laughs> Cut off.、Um, okay. Well, I have full health, so. Okadarahan, it's finally happening. Did hang on to this. I'm going to take as much as I can. All right. What am I going to do about the bridge? I swear I'll find you. The transmitter put him around the spot. Oh, no, if we've crossed the bridge. Magically. The transmitter showed he was around here. Yama Roshi's gotta show his face sometime. Just gotta lie low and wait. Showtime. We finish this now, Yama Orochi. Here it goes. I mean, it's probably going to be multiple shots to the head. This is so tense. Hey, Messiah, how's it going? Hang on. What the hell? Oh my god. Did I die? Oh no, of course, it has to end this way. 
God damn it. <laughs> of, co of course it had to go with a fist fight. Okay, well, it's a good thing I got food. <laughs> so dumb. But I love it. Yep. Sajima so just has to settle things with the fists. Uh oh. I love how this whole hunting thing is just gonna be inconsequential. It's just, well, it's gonna go back to a fist fight. Oh, well, yeah, the parry does nothing. Okay, items. We're back up to full health. <laughs> bear hug. Yeah, it's just a Christmas teddy bear. Wanting a hug. There we go. So this was just straight up just a bear. I thought they weren't going to help. What? You didn't say that Oh, crap. That's さあ、何してるんだ。山おろしは俺らが島津してお安心しろ、サイジマ。警察は俺が呼んだんだ。俺を逮捕させるためにな。どういうことや。この場所で死んだ。私が銃を向けた直後にな。お。お。いつか財団プレイ。何やて。最島。俺はオクデラを殺すために脱獄した。元殺し屋なんだ。オクデラハング殺し屋。あのオクデラという男は東北の極道組織の絶縁。命を狙われる立場にある人間だった。そしてその組織は奴の始末を俺に指示した。だから俺は脱獄したんだ。そうやけどあんた確かその男に遭難したとこを助けられたはずやろ
もし奥寺を殺さなければ俺が殺されるだから俺は9年前のあの日奥寺が山おろしを追いかけて山に入った時殺そうと企てたんだ奥寺が山おろしに殺されたと見せかけるためにくああだが俺は躊躇した俺が奥寺の背中に銃を向けた時奴は言ったよいつ撃ってもいいってな<笑>ほんならまさかああ奥寺は全部知っていたのさ俺が自分を殺そうとしていることは全てな奴はその上で俺を受け入れ生きるという希望を失いかけていた俺に資料を通じて生きる道を教えてくれたそれで結局あんたは撃ったんか撃てなかったこの男を殺すくらいなら自分が組織に命を狙われても構わないと覚悟しただがその瞬間だった黒く巨大なものが奥寺に覆いかぶさったんだ山おろしかそ,その後のことは自分でもよく覚えていない気がついたら俺は奥寺と一緒に真っ赤に染まった雪の上に倒れていたなんてことだそして死に際に奥寺は俺の手を握っていったんだ俺の名を借りて生きろ生きて罪を償えと、okay, okay, but like... 奥寺も罪の多い人生を歩んできたに違いないだからこそ生き残った俺に償いきれなかった悔しい思いを託した、hmm. The only thing about this is So he got sent to assassinate the guy The guy dies And says, take my identity. But wouldn't they just send another assassin? Kore de Orewa omoi no kuskoto a nai. Kondo a chanto hei no naka de. I don't know. I wouldn't exactly take the identity of someone that they're sending assassins for. It's a good story, though. これをちゃんと自分で決着をつけてってくれ。西名、あんたは9年も山おろしを追い続けた。決着をつけれるのはあんたしかいない。あ、そう、ベアズ not actually dead。ちょっとスタンド。さあ、奥寺さん。俺がこの集落に来てから10年近く。量を通じて一つ分かったことがある。なんだ自分が生きるための資料以外は殺戮。俺はな、西名さん。そのことをこの集落、雪山、そしてあんたたちに教わったんだよ。奥寺さん。ここでこの引き金を引けば。俺は10年前に逆戻りだここは一つ漁師としての俺の信念を貫かせてもらえないかうんあなたはこの Hachi san sent the cops packing, and then he took a lot of heat for wasting their time. The bears from all these nearby mountains are still hanging around. But at least Okadera Han's safe. And Yama Urashi ain't about to go near people anytime soon. What? Nothing. Thanks. Don't mention it.
the four bear. It's not dead. It just got into a fight, is all. No more health loss. Now we can track the mountain freely, which, yeah, I mean, that's fine. I've done the story. That's all I wanted to do with it. So now... You've been handling rifles for a good long while. What about it? I'd like to see a skill with my own eyes. Let me know when you've got the time. Ah, uh, the Baba, let's let's go. He's been sitting here patiently. Um, go to town, with Baba. Well, we'll finish saying goodbye to Okadarahan and then head to Tsukimine. It's time. His feelings must be hurt after losing a fist fight against the humans. <laughs> Just pride. It's not the strangest thing to happen on this mountain. There's the dude that had erectile dysfunction that asked for a deer antler. Not sure what he would have done with it. I wish I was making it up, but that's actually what happened. Not on my list of things that I thought I was doing today. Finally, chapter four. I did enjoy that chapter, though. It was fun. Ojikoenでは明日の夜から始まる月見の雪祭りに向けて多くの人々が最後の準備作業を行っています。冬の代名詞とも言われるこのお祭りを見るため、毎年多くの観光客が全国からやってきます。Again, this just feels like a whole other planet to me. Game Crap. <laughs> Don't just stand there in the open, dude. They got your face on a giant screen. What are you doing? Just inconspicuously walk away. Hmm. Yoshi went Monday for me. I'm probably gonna do it in the morning. Ima Yoso Mitekimusaga. Kamari Kibishi Jotai Desne. Keganga Kanari Tematemasne. Odori on the Kete, Snao Ni Ajitoni Kunoa Yabasodes. Because I'm gonna try eggnog and then. That's like a better time for other people to have it. You can upgrade your abilities. Um, ability upgrade. What am I doing? I mean. He is definitely my strongest character. VOD for you. I don't think I'm gonna finish it in one sitting. That's probably gonna be two streams of it because it's, uh... What the 
take at least five hours to finish, I would imagine. Especially if I'm gonna 100% it. I doubt I'll get through it in one sitting. And also, we will probably watch Jingle all the way, so I'm gonna make time for that. Oh, crap, I missed that part. Follow Baba. Where did Baba go? I was looking at the map like an idiot. Oh, there's the arrow on the map. Alright, it's fine. <laughs> yep. Just knocking people over. Hold up, there's a cop. Damn, can't go this way. Baba, you saw the news. My face plastered everywhere. If we stay together, you'll get burned too. Let's pull up and meet at your hideout. But then you... Don't worry about me. I'm used to this sort of thing. How's your pain? Still as bad as it was on the mountain? Ah, uh, hi. This cold's real bad if you're in pain. Hurry on to the hideout. You got your own health to worry about before you uh, go mothering me. Aniki. Okay, I'll do that. I'm sorry, Aniki. So where's this hideout? Ah, uh, there's a major street that runs north to south through the town centre. It's called Central Station Boulevard. And there's a Don Quixote on it. The hideout is called... There's a bar called Pol Polaris. In the building across the street. Gotcha. I'll see you later. Please be careful, Aniki. Alright, across the street from Don Quixote on Central Station Boulevard. Can't be that hard to find. Oh, it's marked. I just have to go treat this like a stealth mission. The cop is still there, so hang on. Can't go that way. I'm trying to remember how long it took me to finish that game last time I played it. get past this. What on earth? Yep, wait a- yep, stopping public transport, that's a way to remain in stealth. Can I sneak past here? Oh, this is risky. My bike. <laughs> oh my god, the cop is right there. Okay. Like I have said many times in the past, stealth, not my thing. I almost got hit by a car and tram. Yeah, you know, keeping a low profile. That's how we do it. Saijima my son, what a relief. Did you have trouble getting here? Nah. So, this is the hideout you were talking about? Yes, it's just up here. Pretty run down.
どうぞ座ってくださいどうやらここ10年の間月見野の町もすっかり変わっちまったみたいですね昔はどの店も繁盛してたんですがなんだか寂しい気分になりますねしかに結構前に潰れたみたいやな。Pretty crazy. あ,あった。ちょっと待ってくださいね。あありますよあちょっと待ってくださいね。I wouldn't trust it. Wash the glasses, dude. Come on. <laughs> What is this? A run at the abandoned bar 10 years and he said there's rats. Wash the glass. I'm sure it's fine to drink, but not out of a glass that's been sitting there for 10 years in a rat infested abandoned bar. Who may not? でも不思議ですよね。本当なら今頃、仮釈放でシャバに出ているはずの二人が、こんな場所でこんなにビクビクしながら、酒を飲むことになるなんて。いつかお前と飲みたい思ってた。悪い気分やない。しかし、どうして西島さんだけ指名手配されてしまったんですかね。俺なんか、実名も公表されないまま。遺体で見つかったことになってましたし。What's a bad point? どういうことなんでしょう ?No idea, kid. やはり、あの刑務所のことも、指名手配も全部、登場会が裏から手を回してやってることなんでしょうかどうしましたちょっと表出るわ。えこんな状況の時にですかはあ。ずっとここおってもラジアがいい。いやでも、表は警官がうようよしてますよ。<笑>大丈夫や。こういう状況にはある意味慣れとる。2年前もそうやったしね。Deal with it the same, huh? でも、so、by that, he means not very well. 北方組の情報でも集めるつもりですかそうやな。北方言う男に会おうにも。どこにおるかわからんことには近づけんしねそういうことでしたらバーアンビシャスという店に行ってみてくださいそこの店なら今でもきっと北方組の人間はいるはずですアンビシャスはいその店の奥には昔から北方組がやってる賭場がありますカウンターの男にチップを渡せば裏カジノに案内してもらえるはずですそこで一暴れしたら、北方の情報も得られるっちゅうわけやな。ええ。でも、十分気をつけてください。北方組は、一度敵とみなした相手には、とことんやるタイプの古い極道組織です。親父のためなら命投げ出すっていう、筋金入りの連中が集まってる組なんで。なおさら楽しみやな、ね。あ、それと、I'm not so concerned with Saijima's plot because he is very leveled up. Yeah. Yeah, the, the, I feel like the health recovery thing should be instant instead of this slow. I mean, it's on full health.
panicky. Hmm. I've got cash. Take some. I got plenty. <laughs> like oh, I'm fine. Just from an old connection in town. You could say that. There's no telling what might happen, so... That's true. Appreciate it. I guess this was just in case you just jumped ahead to this and didn't do the whole hunter story. Urgh, Hakata sure is cold. I hope I find a good place soon. Hopefully a really warm one too. What's with him? Wait, haven't I seen that guy before? Your luck today is terrible. Things won't be going your way, so avoid anything involving luck. What is this? Hello, my friends all over the world. I have a request for you today. Lately, I haven't been able to take perfect shots that I long for, but I had an idea. I want you all to upload any perfect shots you take to the image hosting site. What's with this email? Some kind of mistake? Guess I'll check it out when I get time. I think this is Mac. Ugh. Ah. Hey, you there. I can't take the feeling I've seen you before. What's your name? Is this the kid that was in the town that left? Oh no, it's Tatsuya. Ah. Oh. Ever heard of that celebrity chef Tatsuya? Well, that's me. Maybe you've seen me on TV on so or something. Oh, right. That's where I've seen you. You're some kind of cooking master, aren't you? Well, I'm not just a cook, exactly. These days, I'm doing this spot on a TV show where I help out local eateries across Japan by coming up with new dishes. I don't get it. If you got ideas for new dishes, why don't you use them at your own restaurant? But that's the whole idea for the program, helping others with my new dishes and making sure that their kitchens are running efficiently, providing them business ideas, cleaning up the messes they make, and helping staff make sure that they're taken care of. Nothing derivative. With that in mind, I have to ask, could you recommend any eateries here in... <laughs> Sorry, I'm making a reference to Kitchen Nightmares because we've been watching that. Um, I am from around here, so I really can't say. Oh, you're a tourist, huh? No matter. I still have to ask. Would you let me know if you find a great place that serves local cuisine here in Tsukimino? I'll go try it out, and hopefully it will help me come up with an idea for a new dish. You want me to find tasty eats for you? Ain't that your job? Sure, but there's a limit to how much one person can do. I'll take all the help I can get. You got a point there. Think of it as a good deed. But I understand if you're too busy. Fine. I'll give you a hand if I get around to it. Thank you. And don't worry, I'll make it worth your while. I'll use my vast experience with both cooking, food, and eating it to teach you how to make the most of your meals. Fine, fine. I'll let you know if I find anything. Great, thanks. I'm looking forward to your recommendations. This is Tatsuya the chef. If you come over, yeah, okay. Just reiterating what was just done. I apparently got another email. To the warriors on the warpath? Love weapon? To those of you looking to best arrival, win back the girl, or launch a raid on an enemy's turf, announcing the opening of Kam Kamiyama Works Tsukimino, supporting the needs of all you warriors out there. We have a ride of war oh yeah, okay, it's the weapons dealer guy. I see something. Questionable map scrap A. So you found us at last. Who are you? Yikes, don't give me that look. I was just trying to create a little atmosphere. Eh. Let me introduce myself. I am Tokuyama, head of Tsukimino Merchants Association. What you picked up there is the key item in the treasure hunt event we're holding right now. Treasure hunt? That's right. There are 24 other pieces just like the one you have, so that makes a total of 25 
map pieces scattered around town. A single map piece isn't much use, but as you collect others, you can put them together to make treasure maps. There are five treasure maps in total. In other words, each is split into five pieces. Huh? The five treasure maps scattered around town split into 25 pieces? That's right. And what's more, the completed treasure maps take the form of riddles. We racked our brains and came up with the toughest riddles we could. Only those who solve them can claim the treasure. So what do you say? Have I got you all fired up to go on a treasure hunting adventure? Guess I'll pick them up if I spot them. Oh, don't play coy with me. I know you're all revved up and ready to go, you old grump. Uh, anyway, I uh, hope you enjoy the event. <laughs> okay. I mean, it's not a trading card involving bug women, so... It's not the strangest thing I've picked up in these games. I saw this... Whoa. Hold on. I thought I saw a shimmer. No, that's fine. Okay, that's definitely one. What the hell? So, you know, coincidentally, this has ended up being a Christmas game, which is great. Hey, you alright? Ah. <laughs> I got beat up by a gang of Santa Hunters. Santa Hunters? Look, can you just tell me if you're alright? Yeah, I, I think so. Oh. Well, you can stand at least, that's a good sign. Yes, yeah, sorry to have troubled you. No worries, but what was that you said earlier? Something about Santa Hunters? They're a gang of delinquents. They make a game of beating up retail workers wearing Santa costumes. Wow. Bunch of punks. Because of them, people don't consider the shopping district a safe place anymore. It ruins the festive mood entirely. I'll give them a talking to. I'll give those kids a talking to. Pardon? You're going to what? Lecture them? How? They go after Santas, right? Lend me your outfit. You're going to use yourself as bait? That's nuts! They've got close to ten kids by yourself. You couldn't possibly... Wasn't planning on fighting them. They might just listen to reason. I doubt that. Don't worry. If things get ugly, I'll cut and run. I won't push it. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> this is what I was waiting you, That This is the thumbnail right here. Alright, this should make the Santa Hunters come looking for me. Please be careful. They carry weapons and they're not shy about using them. I'll be fine. Alright, let's go find these so-called Santa Hunters. <laughs> okay. What direction is this going to head in? Oh. Hey, it's Santa! Yay! Heh. <laughs> Cute kids. We're in this get up around town, ain't so bad. Santa, can I have my present now? Oh, oh. What about me? Sorry, Tux. Ain't got nothing on me. At least not stuff that would make good gifts for you. Huh? No fair! I want my present! Please, Santa. No presents. I don't got my, uh, sleigh with me. Why didn't you bring it? Oh. Look, it's Santa. I want a present. What? Santa? Huh, he's here. Santa, can I sit on your lap? Do you have a present for me? What the hell? Where'd all these kids come from? Hey. You all gotta go home and wait till Christmas to get your presents. I can't wait that long. Please, can I have it now, Santa? Let me go get my friends. They want presents too! No, don't don't tell any other kids I'm here. I just posted online where Santa is. Everyone's coming. 
You posted what? Santa, how come you don't have my present? Hey, I was here first. Uh, I just gotta make a break for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> uh, and the music just makes this perfect. Looks like I gave him the slip. <laughs> what is this side quest? Good thing I got away from all that. Hey Santa, got some presents for us? Ah, uh, you must be the Santa Hunters. I've been looking for you. You found us, old Nick. And we're so happy to see you, our third Santa today. We're the town's best Christmas carolers, bashing your head in the snow. In a one-horse open sleigh, over the killing fields we go, laughing all the way. Why are you doing this? Uh, trust me, we're just doing what everyone else wishes we could do. Who isn't sick of all this Christmas shit every fucking year? Yeah, just look at what you're wearing, man. Fucking stupid. Hey, you got... Girlfriends or something? Huh? Shut up! Just, just shut the hell up! <laughs> Too bad your girlfriend won't be here to wash the blood out of your dinky suit. All right. <laughs> I just love how you know I just wanted to play the next Yakuza game, and it has ended up being a Christmas game. Just, it's perfect. Holy crap, that attack got so much stronger now. I thought we said we weren't gonna fight the kids, but I guess we changed our mind, huh? Oh my god. I hear you want a bike for Christmas! <laughs> Here's your bike! Stop, we're sorry, real sorry. Let me sing you a carol now. He's making a list and checking it twice. Gonna figure out who's naughty or nice. Santa Claus is coming to town. You kids. Like I said, I ain't got nothing for you. Come on, you're Santa. How could you not have presents? I'm all out. Well, except for these things here, I guess. Wait, there's a... Wow, baseball hats, just what I wanted. Oh, bats. Whoops. Bats. Sports fan, huh? Take as many as you like, then. Awesome. I want this thing over here, Santa. Nunchaku. You like Kung Fu? Yeah, I watch Kung Fu movies all the time. Yeah! I want my nunchuck. It calls me a fortune. Seems fair to me. These kids could use some real Christmas cheer after you taking it from them all season. You got a problem with that, though? I'm all ears. You're cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's okay. Go ahead, little bros. Take all you want. Yay, this is the best Christmas ever. Thanks, Santa. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> I could get used to this Santa gig. Merry Christmas, everyone. La 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 la. What's going on over there? An accident? Oh, 
couple of trucks crashed, but no one's hurt by the look of things. Help! Someone call the police! The police are coming. Better make myself scarce. Excuse me? What the? Oh my gosh! Bear! A bear came out of the truck! It's the bear from the zoo! Everyone, run! Call the police! Bear! Everyone, move! Run! Ah! Someone! Hey! Over here! This one's like a teddy bear compared to Yama Orochi. Hey, you get away! What are you thinking? You... Heh. <laughs> bring it on. I don't mind ya. Oh, the Christmas stuff isn't actually happening on Chris Christmas. <laughs> I'm away on the 24th. It's, uh, the Sunday thing. That's split into the morning and then later on. Ah, thank you so much, you saved us. You alright? That was close. Sir, if it weren't for you, this would have been a terrible disaster. I don't think I have the words to thank you. This isn't very much, but we want you to have it. And if you're willing, we'd love for you to meet our managers at the zoo. They'll want to thank you in person. Can't stick around. Don't want the cops to notice me. Sorry, uh, I gotta get going. Oh, but... It's all because of you that no one got hurt. Yeah, but... Uh, it's fine. I'll just accept your thanks and be on my way. What a guy. Knocked out a bear with just his fists. Huh, no one would believe us. Okay. Well, I'm just happy to be doing side quests that are just random. <laughs> just nonsensical. I, I love it. Yeah, I mean, it was kind of an impromptu thing. Like, I was always going to do the Yoshi's Island thing, but then the discussion happened when I said I hadn't uh, tried eggnog before. And so I was convinced to try it. And so that's a thing where you have it, I'll do the childhood game thing, and then my other annual tradition is watching Jingle all the way. So that's the loose plan. No, we're back to towns that are gonna randomly attack me. Uh. I'll tell you what, I did not miss this on the mountain. That was so nice. Just being able to go anywhere and not get harassed. Yeah, you know, way to, way to be inconspicuous, just, I was on TV anywhere and everywhere, and so the way I lay low is just beating the crap out of people with a giant scooter. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh wow, there are so many side quests here. That's, this is cool. Apparently there's another one in this alley. Is this Santa part 2? It might be. Hey, little lady, what's wrong? You look like you're gonna faint. Huh, I'm okay. Do you know Matsuo Lamb Barbecue? It's a restaurant. You want to know where it is? No, I, I know where it is. I checked online. So, what's going on? Why are you so unsteady on your feet? I've been fasting a really long time because I'm getting ready to eat the best lamb barbecue ever. That actually does sound good. 
An empty stomach is the best seasoning. Nuts to that, I thought you were in real trouble. Wait, this wasn't a quest? Wait, please, could you take me to Matsuo Lamb Barbecue? I, I don't, I'm not sure I can stand up straight much longer. Fine. Where is it? On Nakasuki Street. Alright, I'll take you there. It's nearby. Oh, thank you very much. I was about to pick up a treasure map piece. This is it, right? Matsuo Lamb Barbecue. Yes, finally I can enjoy the legendary lamb barbecue. Alright, little lady. Mind if I go now? Wait, let me treat you to dinner. As a thanks for me bringing me here. No need for that. Uh, uh I haven't fallen so low that I'd let a young person feed me. Please. Aren't people your age always asking young people to show more gratitude? Huh. Alright. Nice comeback. Wonderful. My name is Mami Yamashita. I'm a food journalist. So, you're eating here for your job? <laughs> oh no, this is my private time. So, there's no problem with me treating you. Alright then, I'm Saijima. Let's not waste any time, Saijima-san. The lamb barbecue here is legendary. The la ah, the lambs are selected from the best flocks in New Zealand, and the sauce is made according to a secret recipe that took 10 years to perfect. Everyone says this place blows its competitors away. Huh. You know all about the joint before a single bite. Well, it's... Reputation is why I've been fasting since yesterday. Huh? You said you were fasting a long time. One day ain't a long time. Sajima san, why don't you let me order for the both of us? I've done all the research. Alright. It's on you, little lady. Wait, oi mommy, what? Oh, her name. I didn't even I didn't even realize I said that. Um so this is the famous lamb barbecue. It smells good. Don't hold back. Let's eat. If they showed the picture of the lamb, I'd, I'd be hungry right now. Great stuff. The lamb ain't even gamey. Isn't that amazing? It's league above beyond other lamb barbecue. I didn't read that sentence correctly. Yum. This was so worth the fast. I could eat, keep eating this forever. Wow, she's still gone. Incredible. Hmm, so good. Hey, you done yet? Uh, I gotta go, though. I am amazed at how you can put it away. <laughs> this is normal for me. I usually eat about three big bowls of just rice. I love rice. Oh, yeah? By the way, Saijima-san, what do you do for work? Uh, well, I am Santa Claus. I see. <laughs> Sorry, I had to add that. What about you? A food journalist full-time? Unfortunately, no. I also do some acting. Like, TV and dramas. Well, that's interesting. I would not be able to eat three bowls of rice. Like, rice is super filling. It's just, man, to eat that much rice. I, one and one and a half at most. Well, that's interesting. Like those tiny bowls, right? It depends on the bowl size, but if we're talking about the typical restaurant size. I'm not a big star or anything, but I like it. I also want to do voice acting eventually, because voice acting is a great career. I, I, I didn't want to sound facetious. <laughs> I should have said something more like, you could totally voice act and just uh, do it on the internet, yeah? Just make funny voices and people will watch you. And I may ask you something that's important. Uh, what is it? Come on. Spit it out. I think I might order more barbecue. Do you mind? Oh...
I had a co- I had a co-worker a long time ago. She ate more than me. Like, it was pretty much the scenario. We'd go out to eat, most of us would be done, and she'd order more. And she was... If you would look at her, you would think, oh man, she doesn't eat much. <laughs> Just insane metabolism. You okay with springing for dinner? Of course, I ate most of it after all. Good point. Oh, I almost forgot. What? Would you tell me the tastiest thing you've eaten recently? What do you mean? It's something I always ask whenever I meet someone new. That's how I found out about Matsuo Lamb Barbecue. The question has led me to so many delicious food discoveries. So, I'm certainly going to keep asking it. I gotcha. Alright, the tastiest thing recently, well, had to be deer stew. Deer stew? I've never had that. I had it in this one hunting village, got lost in a blizzard, and the man who saved me gave me some. Best meal of my life. What did it taste like? Uh, you know, uh, I'd heard deer had a particular odor to it, but all I know is the stuff smelled great. Could have been the miso, I, I guess. They don't boil the deer meat all the way through. They serve it while it's nice and tender. The whole thing was fantastic. Wow, a brand new flavor. One I've never tried before. I can't wait to taste it. Well, next time I'm on the mountain, I'll hunt you some deer. It'll be my thanks for the lamb barbecue. Yeah. No, no, no. That would take too long. One, once the dish is in my mind, I want it in my stomach too as soon as possible. You mean now? But well, we just ate. <laughs> Oh, I can always find room for new flavors. No time to waste. Thank you very much, Saijima-san. I'm heading up the mountain for some deer stew. Is she serious about going up the mountain? No, can't be. No one's that extreme a foodie, are they? <laughs> I don't want to hear it. 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 I don't want to... I don't want to hear comments about extreme foodie. I will have none of that. Help! Somebody! Hmm? What's going on? Please! Oh, please, in heaven's name! Is that a delivery guy? Is he hurt or something? Wait a sec. The road's completely coated in ice. Sir, are you coming to help me? When I slipped, I landed awkwardly and now I can't move. Yeah, but across the street, I'm just as likely to wipe out. What do you expect me to do? Maybe if you just walk carefully? I guess that is the only way, but... Please! There isn't a second to waste! Oh, alright. Guess I should help him. Oh look, I might have my first experience with slipping on ice. Hurry to the fallen delivery man, but since the road is dangerously slick with ice, you should approach it gingerly. If you run, you might trip, which will just slow you down. Okay, place your bets how long before I slip on the ice. Will I make it to the other end without slipping? Or will I slip immediately? It's just, you know, this is my... Though it's not happening to me in real life, right? I live in Australia. I've never had ice. I've never slipped on ice. I've been to the snow, but there is no condition like this here. And people laughed at me when I said I had never slipped on ice in disbelief. So... All right, here we go. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I got an idea, I got an idea, I got an idea. Just a sec. Wait, why is he still walking? I stopped. Oh no, you can't stop walking. This is autom- Ooh, ooh, what is it doing? Oh, this is- this is gonna be an interesting thing. Alright, like, let Saijima walk into the wall whilst I do something else. 
Just a sec, chat. This is important. I feel like this is helping. Alright, I made it. <laughs> made it, are you okay? It doesn't matter, right now this ramen is more important. What? Please, I know you don't know me, but could you deliver it what uh, how is this ramen more important than you being hurt please just help me fine where am I supposed to take it exactly the customer is waiting on uh, at the corner over there hmm What a random place to get ramen. Hey, over here! Hurry that up! Oh no, he's already annoyed. Please! Leave me behind. Just save the ramen! Soon the noodles will get all soggy. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll take care of this. But you need to relax, fella. I, I can't. I'm still worried about you walking across this slippery ride if you fall, the ramen won't survive. Please just be careful. It'll be okay. The ramen's gonna make it. Keep in mind, it's not other people may slip and slip. Oh, oh my god. Alright, here we go. What the? What the? What, whoa! 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 What is this? What is this? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> you <can live. laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh shit! No! 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 <laughs> this has been one of the best missions in a while. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here's your order. Thank you, my good man. Kudos to you for making across such a slick street. If you want to praise someone, it should be that delivery guy over there. I'm just helping him because of how dedicated he is to his job. Ah, a true professional. Well, I'm sure this ramen will be all the tastier for it. Huh, enjoy. One of them almost got me. You, you did it! Huh, <laughs> just glad to be useful. You definitely were. And you helped a total stranger. I mean, I just don't have the words to thank you properly. So instead, here's a small gift. Balance bracelet? Oh, so I won't slip on ice now? Keeps you from stumbling when you run into someone at full speed. Hell yeah. That's going... Ah, <laughs> oh, the, the side stories so far have been amazing in this town. Cops, best steer clear. Trying. <laughs> it's okay, I'm not drawing attention to myself. Crap.
Hang on. Just trying to use my brute strength. What is God? What is just blocking everything? <laughs> That'll do it. I can't. I want to get to... I mean, how do I... It doesn't let me cross here. Oh, here we go. This town is weird. Okay, another treasure map piece. Hang on. What's this? Nothing. <laughs> is it really that bad when you slip and slide on ice? Like, do you go fly? Do you go flying? Do you slide like those dudes were? I have no frame of reference, really. So, you know, that um, is a cabinet that probably provides internet access to this entire part of the series. <laughs> this city. You just took it out, that's, that's fine. I'm sure no one's gonna be pissed. What are you doing? Calling for help? There's no help! I think he actually pulled it off. Damn it. I got that just slightly too late. So quite clearly there was a big advantage to doing all the stuff on the mountain. It's just made me insanely strong. Oh my god. Hmm. Anyone sick of this cold weather? Why are you looking around like that? I'm scoping out the crowd for anyone else feeling cold. Anyone who... Wait a sec. Look at you. You must hate the cold. Huh? Who are you and why do you care? Oh, I'm sorry. My name is Adeno. I'm an inventor. I need a product tester who's feeling cold. You good, sir? Appear to be such a fellow. What with your shorn hair and destitute apparel? How about it? Destitute? That's rude of you. But what do you want to test? I've been developing gear that will get people through these harsh winters in perfectly warm, cozy comfort. I just completed the first prototype. That's why I need one lucky guinea- <clears throat> uh, I, I, I mean, I meant to say tester. A tester for my amazing prototype. Gear that makes this sort of weather comfortable? Sure, that'd be convenient. Right. This product could be huge. Even people who can't stand the cold would be able to live in Tsukimina. The town would grow like crazy. Looks like you're not from around here, so you're not used to the climate. That makes you the perfect tester. There's compensation, of course. I wouldn't ask you to do this for free. <laughs> After all, as soon as this thing becomes a product, I'll be a millionaire. <laughs> Being warm sounds great. What to do? Give it a try. Alright. It does sound interesting. Let me try it. Excellent decision, sir. Please follow me. Hmm? I can't just try it out right here. 
Do you know how hard it is to get a patent? Someone could see my invention and steal it, and then where would I be? Oh boy. Well, alright. So, where's this ultimate cold weather gear? <laughs> right in my hand. What? That? That looks like a pocket warmer. <laughs> you might think that. Yes, however, this is no ordinary pocket warmer. It's the ultimate pocket warmer. Is that so? Yes, it produces several thousand times the heat of a regular one. Truly, it is the king of pocket warmers. With one of these, Sikimino will feel like a tropical paradise. Heck, so would Antarctica. So would the moon. The moon ain't happening. And did you say it's thousands times hotter than the regular one? Wouldn't that start a fire? Uh, it'll probably be fine. I just adjusted some things, so it shouldn't ignite. You ain't doing a good job of selling me on safety. Getting kind of scared here. Oh, please, a big man like you. Very well. I'll demonstrate first and prove that it is perfectly safe. After that, you can test it. That sound okay? Alright. Here we go. First, I activate the unit. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Did I screw something up? Should have seen this coming. Hey, do something before the whole place burns down. There's a fire extinguisher over there. Please put it out. Better put this out first. Then I'll deal with Edeno the idiot. <laughs> well, you know, I... <laughs> I said I wanted to be a firefighter as a child. This is me living vicariously. Making a childhood dream come true. And also reinforcing why I would not choose to do so. The first five seconds I felt, you know what? I made the right choice. Ha. <laughs> <sighs> that was close. Eh. Um. How was it? Made you warm like it was supposed to, didn't it? You want me to kill you? <laughs> Never mind. I'm truly sorry. The temperature calibration was a little off. It's not an easy thing developing products. It was more than a little off. We could have died in there. I deeply apologize. Please accept this as recompense. Please accept this too. Uh, I'm just so sorry. A po <laughs> I sure as hell don't want this pocket warmer if you made it. Oh, no. No, no, no. Of course not. This was made by someone else. Please, there's nothing to worry about. I promise I'm not trying to make you into a guinea pig again. Honest, I'm not. You sure about that? Yes, uh, of course. If you're lying... This ain't gonna end well. I understand that. So? Um... I'm waiting. <laughs> yes, of course. I'm terribly sorry. It was actually one of my own prototypes. I'll take it back. Thought so. <laughs> Incredible. You saw through my lies with such ease. It's like... You're the Buddha himself. I'm no enlightened man, I assure you. You need to stop spouting nonsense and experimenting with your death traps. If I see anybody with one of them... Alright, I got it! I won't try to make the world a better place anymore, sheesh! Guy's a public health hazard. At least I ain't cold anymore, though. ba da ba ba da ba <laughs> Punchline. I gotta say, Saijima's chapter has been fantastic. 
just... Story, I'm into the story, but then these... These side stories, all of them have been good. And I haven't even gotten to the part where we get to the entertainment that is in this town. Like, I'm sure there's some fun things to do. Always in an alleyway. What now? Hey. You alright? Uh, uh. The man's freezing. Gotta get some warm food in him. Um. I guess I have to go buy some? Let's look at the map. Oh, cool. Don Quixote might have something. Yeah. Oh, no, it's him. Ah, there you are. Finding great places. Recommend an eatery. Wait, we went to the lamb barbecue. Lies. I guess it didn't count because I didn't buy it. Listen to the music in the background. For anyone that's worked retail, something like this would drive you insane. Like having a shift that lasts like eight hours and you have that music playing on a loop <laughs> drive you insane. I mean... <laughs> Let's listen to it. I wonder if I can just provide, like, this, right? We'll give him a Chinese chicken soup. I would assume that... We make the soup. What? I'm an idiot, I'll walk past him. Hey, you're right. There we go. Snow cabbage, minced chicken, sesame oil, and chicken broth with tasty low calorie noodles. Hey, can you eat this? Uh. Hey, looks like you're feeling better. <sighs> Thank you, I'm feeling better. My name's Kiyama, by the way. I'm Saijima. Can't be easy being homeless in the snow. Yeah. It's no winter wonderland for guys like me, the nights are just awful. Can you sleep? Only if I'm exhausted, then I try to find a spot with a roof. Subway entrance or something, and bundle up in my blankets. Even then, the cold is something terrible. I try to stay awake all night, sleeping during the day is safer because you're less likely to freeze to death. I see. Yeah. I've lived here a long time, but I can't keep this up. That's why I'm making my way to Tokyo, warmer there. Maybe I could start over somehow. You won't be as cold there, but the city's got more troublemakers, you know? You okay for money? Sometimes I get day labor jobs from the government and I've been saving up. It's gonna cost me 10,000 yen to get to Tokyo, that's the goal. If you don't mind, I can help you with money. You've already helped me enough, but thanks for the offer. I'm close to my goal and I want to finish it on my own. Alright. Got it. I've got work today, in fact. I should go now. Sure. You take care. That's awfully nice of him. We'll probably see him again. I reckon we'll run into him later. Another treasure map. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> 
treasure oh yes um where am i heading okay i want to do more of the side stories all of them have been great so far no Damn it! Ugh. There was another one here. Okay, well. Trying to pick up the big thing, like I did last time. There we go. Pick it up. Pick it up! There it is! <laughs> that was a little on this. That was a little unnecessary. The dude just needed one more punch. Hang on. Ah, oh, damn it. He faded. No. There we go. Oh, it's him. Assholes, give it back. Shut up, you loser. What's a homeless guy need with cash anyway? Think of us working folk who pay for our own shit. Yeah, look at how much he's got. 10,000 yen in loose change. <laughs> he must have been saving up every handout for months. That money is for my train fare to Tokyo, please. What? You wanna go be homeless there and be a nuisance to this good citizens of Tokyo? We can't allow that. We're being good Samaritans by taking this money. I second that. It's better spent on our lunch anyway. Hold it. Daijima san. You want something, dickwad? Give the money back. This ain't your business. Oh shit, it's, it's him. The day he broke out of prison, he was on TV, remember? Huh? Seriously? Hey, if we catch him ourselves, then we'll be really good Samaritans. Good point. It'll be easy with the five of us. Let's take him. Heh. <laughs> Everyone calls me a hero. Nikki will finally drop her panties. This is my lucky day. I'll show you how a lucky day you're having. Come on. How lucky a day you're having, because I can read properly and it's not almost one in the fucking morning. Come here! <laughs> Alright, I don't know. Right, I've... The midnight brain has kicked in, chat. I think I need to go to bed soon. Or at least stop playing games. <laughs> if nothing else. Keep releasing the button too early. Holy shit, he went flying. There we go. Five of ya, that's the best you can do. Hi, my son Yeah, it's your money. Now get going. You heard what they said. You don't want to be seen with me. You're an escaped convict for real? Yeah. I see. Saijima san, that doesn't change the fact that you saved my life. And I... I have to believe you had a good reason to break out of prison. You don't seem like someone who would do that out of selfishness. Kayamahan. Um, could you wait here a moment? I can, but why? I'll be right back. Sorry to keep you waiting. 
what were you doing? I couldn't let you go without thanking you. Pack of high-grade cigarettes. You went and bought this for me, but you need your money for Tokyo. Ha! <laughs> That's true, but I needed to show you how I feel. It's not much, but it's the best I can do. It's great. In fact, nothing's ever made me feel more grateful. Thanks. Damn, it's the cops. Alright, Kiyamahan. Hope things work out for you in Tokyo. Please take care of yourself. <laughs> he legged it pretty quickly. Okay. Yeah, there's two more. I'm terrible with directions. I will be opening the map constantly. Street performer? Uh, what am I gonna do? I I'm stumped. What's this wacky get up? The street performer or something? Sorry, sir. Uh, I'm not performing right now. You sure about that? The way you're dressed, I'm expecting you to squirt water out of a flower any second. I just met with the festival organizers. I haven't had a chance to change. Whatever. You take care. Wait. Uh, stay a moment? Huh? You came to see the snow festival, didn't you? Can I get your opinion on something? Depends on what... My name's Inari. I was invited to add a little pizzazz to the festival. So I put together a few acts to show the organizers. And they didn't like any of it. They want me to do something with a local bent, something that fits the snow festival theme. A street performance with a snow festival theme? What the hell would that be? Exactly! I have no idea. Snow is white, maybe something white? White sugar? I could bake a cake? While juggling? Ugh, <sighs> that's stupid. I'm running out of time. So you're asking random passerby for idea? Ideas? I can't read anymore. <laughs> I thought a visitor might have a fresh perspective on the snow festival. Not me. I ain't even for the snow. I ain't even here for the snow festival. Ow. Oh, I just assume. I'm quite sorry. It's fine. Look, uh, I feel for you, but I ain't exactly a guy who thinks up candy-ass festival ideas. Sure, but hey, if you see anything around here that inspires you, come back and tell me. I'm not trying to enlist you, just please. If you happen to be struck by an idea, I'd love to hear it. You're some kind of desperate. Alright, if I find something interesting, I'll let you know. Thank you. I'll be right here, racking my brains. Snow festival theme, huh? These snow statues gotta be it. Might as well look at them. Hmm. This snowman's huge. How many hours did some poor yap spend rolling these snowballs? Heck, rolling a giant snowball is something. Maybe that's an idea for a street performer. Is it really just this? Oh, hello. Eh, it's no good. I can't come up with any ideas. You really a performer? You'd think a pro could come up with something. You're right. I should just quit. That would be better for everyone. Hey, not so fast. Come on. You gotta show a little more fight than that. Easy for you to say. Well, I did find something that might help you. Really? What is it? What do you think of a snowman? Uh, snowman? Yeah. You see the big snowman over there? Why don't you roll giant snowballs by riding on top of them and make a huge snowman? Ride giant snowballs and make a snowman? I love that! I'm going with it! 
You're gonna use my idea just like that? Did ya even do any thinking of your own? Of course I did. I, I thought about it so hard I forgot all my good ideas. But yours is so much better anyway. You even cleverly incorporated the fact that I'm an expert ball rider. I tip my hat to you, sir. Uh, I don't incorporate nothing. How can you be an expert ball? Okay, I need a practice. Now I know, I'll do more than just ride the snowball. I'll juggle at the same time. Wow. You listening to this? Ideas are pouring out of me now. Pouring out of you? All you did was add juggling. Don't get hung up on the details. Anyway, thank you so much. You're my savior. I'll put together a new act, and I hope you'll come see it. Uh, if I got time. Ooh, yeah, I'm gonna be a star. Not sure how that's gonna go, but at least the fella's happy. <laughs> We're gonna see more of him, aren't we? Okay, uh, well, there's one more left on the board, so let's do it. There'll most likely be a part two to that one. Oh. <laughs> I was about to just bump into the cup. Look, it's it's all, it's almost 1 a.m. Just the, these things, they happen. It's a good thing the game is so lenient. But if this was a stealth mission, I, I would have failed already. Oh, this is nice looking. Ooh. Ooh. I should go to bed, I'm making noises. <laughs> Snow sculpting is nice. I haven't seen any in real life. I'd like to. This is just the whole, well, at some point I want to experience like a real winter. Why can't people ever do things right? What's wrong? Oh, um, I'm the Snow Festival Operations Manager. My staff pulled a bonehead move that might ruin everything. I just learned that no one ordered site maps for the visitors. If we don't order them right now, the printers won't have enough time, but... Ah, damn it! What's keeping you? Order it now. I'd love to, but my memory is foggy when it comes to which snow statues are at which locations. And I can't leave my post to go check, and my staff is too busy doing a million other things. I get it. You're undermanned. Exactly. You understand. Hey, wait a minute. Maybe you have some spare time? Hmm? I hate to impose, but... Would you be willing to check the snow statue locations? Me? I can't pay you, but I could give you a festival souvenir for your efforts. It shouldn't take long, and it would be a huge help. Don't know. That's asking a lot. Oh, please. We're desperate. So, you want me to see what statues are on the site and where, right? Yes, I'll be right here when you come back. I have to be, after all. You just have to have good gloves. Oh, I would imagine so. So what, it's like bear, bear, fox, penguin. Castle. I have to write this down. <laughs> I'm not, the brain is like, Approaching mush status, so... What was it? It was like, bear, fox, penguin... And then directly north of it is... Little girl... I'll just say LGs for short. 
Um, oh, there's two little girls. And then dragon. Hang on. Spear. Is that Hatsune Miku? Oh no, magic wand. Why did I say spear? I thought that was a spear. <laughs> it's a magic wand. Um, right, so it's like magic wand. Miku. And then dragon. And then whale to the side. I think it's Miku. It looks like Miku. I saw her at the Sega arcade in another town. Seals in the middle. Hang on. Wait. Do I have to... Over there too, or just here? It might just be here. Let's see what he says. <laughs> okay. Can't walk through that. So, are we able to check out the snow statue? Describe the site layout. Yeah, I can tell you what the snow statues are. Fantastic, let's get right to it. While well, your memory's fresh, so... Look at the side from here. There's a giant slide facing... ...from the front, so what's your right? Oh, crap. I guess I didn't pay attention, huh? I just took note of the animals. <laughs> well... Um, duh, 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 duh. is it a bet? I mean, the magic girl is probably the answer. Because the other ones I don't recognize. Oh, I don't know. I almost feel like I should look this up. Uh, oh, I don't know. What do, what do we think? <laughs> I guess I'm gonna get this wrong, huh? We'll go Magic Girl. Not sure what she's supposed to be. Oh, yes, that's right, I remember now. That's the Magic Girl statue. Okay, next, the next one I need to know about, which snow statue is right in the middle? Seals. Some seals are smack dab in the middle. Oh, right. There were seals. This is very helpful. Across from the slide, there's another diorama. A massive one, if I recall. What did it feature? Whale. That'd be a whale. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot about the whale. Even though it's so big. There's only one statue left to confirm. What was the small one next to the penguin? Okay, this one I can answer. Um... Fox. Hold on. It is Miku. <laughs> A fox. Ah, that's where the fox is. Okay, I know the location of all the statues now. Well, thank you very much. You can't imagine what a big help that was. Oh, are you there? Yes? I got the site layout with all the statue locations. It's all on this note, so... Go have the map printed, okay? Understood. I'll place an order with the printers now. Thank you again. I couldn't have done it without you. Accept the souvenir of the event. Mystery stone. Thanks, and hey, good luck. Look forward to your snow festival. Yeah, that was Miku. Alright. No side quests on, on the board at all, so let's 
Head for progress, I guess. This is the one complaint I have of this. Ah! Damn it, that dude blocked me. I pressed the wrong button. It's okay. Why can't I beat it? That one didn't seem like an ordinary street punk. That was an impressive fight, Tiger Saijima san. Who are you? We've been watching you. It would seem you've been trying to avoid attention. That man you defeated is in the qualifying round of the Victory Road tournament. Victory Road? The Victory Road is an underground fighting contest with qualifiers held Current, concurrently all over Japan. That's how we read shit. Its sole purpose is to find the ultimate fighter in all of Japan. As for me, I help run the tournament. What's this got to do with me? Anyone as strong as you are has everything to do with our tournament. But be warned, from now on, other Victory Road contenders will be gunning for you. Defeat all the contenders here in town and I'll see you at the finals. Can you become the ultimate fighter, Saijima-san? And if I got other things to do, you'll come around. Your kind always does. Now, if you'll excuse me. Sounds like another pain in the ass. Alright. <laughs> it's, it's the same thing that we had to do with Kiryu. Um, I guess... What's the quickest way? Can I take a cab? I can probably take a cab. This is a cab, right? No? It's something else, it's a truck. Alright. This is the only pain about this town, is it's very hard to escape fights. Because you can't walk along the main street. So many people. No. No. <laughs> oh wait, there's there's a new side quest. It's like the third time I think I've almost run into that cop. Oh. Can I cross here? Yeah, okay. Hey, you alright? You feeling sick? You, who are you? Uh, uh, are you competing in the qualifiers too? Huh? The name's Shirasaka. Kanta Shirasaka. I'm in the Victory Road qualifiers. By the look of you, I'd say you're competing in the Victory Road too. Am I right? As you can see, uh, I just got the shit kicked out of me. I haven't won a single bout. I just can't seem to shine when I'm up against humans. What do you mean? I'm a hunter. I've even wrestled a bear into submission up in the mountains. I can keep up with the best when it comes to strength, but I learned to fight against animals, not people, so I worry I'll get laughed at if I use my usual approach. Ain't every day you hear a story like that. Why'd you sign up for the victory road then? I figured it was about time I saw the city. 
My dad wants me to become a hunter like him, but I'm sick of life out in the sticks. Then forget about what other people think. Just be yourself and fight how you want. When it comes to fighting, ain't no such thing as a city boy or country boy style. You reckon? Better be yourself when you brawl. Otherwise, it shows disrespect to the guy you're going up against. I see. What's your name? Dijima. Dijima san, huh? I feel like I've finally seen the light. The. It's alright to fight the way I know how to. I don't need to worry about what people think. Of course not. Then I think I'm ready for a fresh start. Yeah, I can do this. Thanks, Saijima san. Be seeing you. Huh. Interesting guy. You never know who you're gonna meet on the victory road, I guess. I almost said straight. Go away! <laughs> Go away, leave me alone. Wait. Okay, and then... Well... Probably quicker to go this way. And then into the alley. Oh my god. This is what you get for interrupting my progression. <laughs> Stop. He's already dead. Stop. <laughs> He's not dead. Though he should be. Okay. Ambitious bar. Where does Kitakata members go? There are a lot. Alright, so we're just looking for someone. Hmm? Say there. You had a time. How about a game of billiards? Refuse? Sorry, I ain't got that sort of time. That's so. Uh, too bad. I don't know who this is. It could very well be the person we're looking for. Welcome. How do I get into the casino? I don't know what you mean. This is a bar. Yeah. Should have figured you'd want a tip. How much? I really have no idea what you're talking about. There is no gambling here. If it's a drink you want, I can do that. We are a bar, you know. He's not Biden. What's up with this? I'm sorry, sir. This area is closed to the public. Who are we talking to then? Evening. Uh huh. Hey, you shoot pull? I'm so tired of playing the regulars here. Can I challenge you to a match? Sorry, not now. Don't you want to know how to get into the casino? Who are you? That's not important. But come on, how about it? If you win, I'll tell you how to get in. Or, if you're not much of a pool player... Well, I've already said too much. Why don't we forget we ever talked, and I'll settle... I'll let you settle my bar tab today. 50 grand. What? Sorry, but I can't trust you. It's not like you to have any other leads, do you? Whatever. 
Oh, you changed my oh, okay, fine. We'll play a game of pool. I'll take you on. Very well. May the best man win. There's no betting, so it's like... I have no idea, 8-ball. You could do. He's the player, okay. Before playing, you must decide who goes first. Each player strikes the cue ball. However, the ball must hit the opposing cushion once in order to be counted. Then should be paid to a degree. Affects the power of the shot. Release the right stick to execute the shot. Now, let's have you try it yourself. Whoops. That was stupid. Yeah, well. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that out there. Okay. Um, oh yeah, well, it seems straightforward enough. Okay. Oh, wow, okay, this is, yep, hold on. I should have paid the 50 grand, huh? Probably did it too, too hard. I hope the music in the background doesn't like cause copyright <laughs> problems. Guess mm. yeah. Ooh, gonna be tough. I don't want to do like a full power shot. I can't believe nothing went in. <laughs> really? Oh crap, well... Okay. Alright, so I'm going for fires. Stop the shit! Oh, it's him, not me. I thought I had done that accidentally. I have no idea how to do a soft shot. I kind of did it, though. Uh, yeah. So nice, Ok, 
a full force. Uh oh. <laughs> well, I said I was gonna lose. I mean, I hope I got the instructions either way. Oh, that's bullshit. That's like some... Oh, it's not looking good. I, I don't really care at this point. Let's just get, get this done as quick as possible. That's fine. <laughs> I've, I've, uh, I've come to terms with the fact that I'm going to lose. Beats paying the 50 grand, I guess. Man. Now this dude's just showing off. Well, we can't... Oh, he might be able to sink it. Yeah. Yeah, okay, it's over. <laughs> I'd be doing better if this was real life, Paul. It's just... Ugh. Ha ha, I knew I'd win, ha ha ha! What a blowhard. Ha! Don't take it too hard, I'm available for a rematch anytime. Oh, would I have to beat him? Fuck that. <laughs> I have 50 grand. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not about to like hit my head against this brick wall. Hmm, disappointing. Well, I'll just drown my sorrows in alcohol then. Tell me about the casino, you promised. Yeah, okay. So the club had to change its system after the police cracked down on it. Now you have to have a pass to get in. Okay, where do I get one? That, I don't know. Hiyotaka might, though. Who's that? He's this homeless guy. He's really old. An old homeless guy? No, it's a real classy place this casino's gotta be. I have any idea where this guy is? Nah, but, I mean, wouldn't he go somewhere? He'd be sheltered? That's what I would do, heck. You mean, somewhere with a roof. I doubt he'd be allowed to loiter in stores. Come to think of it, there was that covered shopping area in Tsukimino. You'd be sheltered without having to go inside stores there. Okay, I'm gonna go find them. Good luck. Alright. Having to win a game of pool? No. I could probably do it. If I had enough attempts, I could I could do it, but I don't want to subject you to this. I need a pass for the casino. Huh? That that old homeless guy. Okay, Kiyotaka Kiyo, Kiyo has one. I can read. I can read damn well. Um... Hmm. Interesting. Okay. 
this, just keep heading up the street. There is a, uh, a sub-story up ahead. Long time no see, do you remember me, Saijima-san? Huh? It's Kanta Shirasaka, the hunter taking part in the victory road. Oh yeah, that's right. Thanks to your advice, I'm on a winning streak in the victory road qualifiers. I went back to my own way of fighting. I'm a completely new man. I didn't expect to come to this, but you're the next one I have to defeat. The victory road is within sight. I know you're, you really helped me out, but that's not going to stop me from doing my best to lay you flat. Lay you out flat. Alright. <laughs> Just immediately pick up a pole. Oops, that didn't tap it enough. No, I got it. Shit. That attack is ridiculous. It didn't do that much though, but what cool. That this back slap thing is, is amazing. Keep using it, eventually he'll go down. <laughs> so dumb. That's better. No way, I can't beat a bear. How can I lose? Oh, I can beat a bear. How can I lose to a man? That's how you fight, huh? Uh, I gotta tell you though, that wasn't really fighting. That was hunting. What do you mean? You better not be mocking me. Hunting is my livelihood. That ain't it. You were too eager to hunt me down. That'll only get you so far. Yeah. The hell does that mean? You fight without guile. Only focus on taking down your prey with one shot. That makes you easy to predict. Damn! You take down a weaker foe easy, sure. But that ain't gonna fly when you fight an equal. That's where real fighting begins. I see. Uh, seems like I have to go back to the drawing board. Well, this is the second time you set me straight, Saijima son. Mark my words, I won't be so easy to beat next time. Good. I'll be seeing you, Sajima san. <laughs> I don't want to put him on the right track. Alright. Dude, his health bar is like off the charts now. Covered shopping area. I feel like I've seen something that fits that description. What? Oh, man. I just can't go about my business. <laughs> Jeez. 
enemies. Just repeatedly pick up the same guy and use him as a weapon. <laughs> I love that attack. Oh, come on! Are you kidding? I just... Ah! <laughs> Wanker! Yeah, I bet you regret it now. Re regret your choices. Come here. I can't believe that was just so back to back. Oh, that, okay, that bike just dropped into existence. I mean, that looks like an underground shopping area. This is what I was thinking. Okay, so it's not here. I'm trying to... Okay. Because unfortunately... Oh, here. It's gotta be here. Excuse me, do you have a minute? Hmm? What do you want? I'm from the Tsukimono Tourism Board. Right now we're running a campaign to raise Tsukimono's profile as a tourist destination. An advertising campaign? Sounds like a good idea. Yes, I'd like to ask you to take some photos around places. Oh yeah, okay, it's this thing again. Five spots. I ain't got a camera though. Oh, no problem. Let me land you one. Yeah? How much are you gonna charge me? Oh no, I'll loan it to you for free. I do need you to give me a way to reach you. Guess there's no reason to turn them down. Might as well take up the offer. Right. I mean, it's the same thing Kiri was doing. That's why I, I glossed over it. I didn't find the five spots for Kiri, so you know. <laughs> this probably won't happen either. Oh, come on, man. I just want to find the homeless dude I'm looking for. I hit all of them. I love how they got scared. I think they could be here. I 
has to be here. This is covered. There's a prisoner on the loose. Oh. Yeah, no, that's... Okay, there's more here. Oh, hang on. Photograph. Okay, that's one. Probably won't find the rest. There, is that Kiyotaka? Hey, are you Kiyotaka? Why do you want to know? Why are you accusing me of? Uh, I ain't accusing you of nothing. I just want to pass to get into the hidden casino at Ambitious. It's a bar. Well, you know, we almost get accused of everything if we're not. Just outright ignored. Do you even know how many of us were in Hokkaido in January 2012? Huh? Consider this a pop quiz for the prize you seek. It's a real number. The Ministry of Health, Labor, and Welfare count us up. Count us up. Quick! Quick! How many? How many homeless? Uh. What? makes no sense. What do you mean? Bzzz, raw, ow, I'm not talking unless you get it right. <laughs> what? <laughs> but it's such a small number. Like, what do you mean? How am I supposed to know how many homeless? I guess I'll ask around. Okay. Uh... I had the, uh, the dancing. Okay. Ugh. How am I gonna do this? Can I just bribe him? What is this? Hang on. In the other games, you just give them a beer and you don't have to do the thing. Molden Lane. Pawn. Don Quixote. I mean, let's go to Don Quixote. I'm gonna try it. Nope, leave me alone! There's usually some... Oh, you know what, I should probably purchase some of these as well. Um, but that's not what I'm after. I hope this is like the other games. Otherwise, well, I guess we'll have to talk to people. Excuse me. You were good. Oh, I didn't do the old man voice. <laughs> it's alright. I repeat my question. According to the Ministry of Health, Labor and Welfare, how many homeless were in Hokkaido? 
I guess it doesn't work. I don't know, man. Like... 70. <laughs> this is not gonna work. 71. Really? I just started with the meme number and just went up by one each time. Alright. Uh, yep, I brute forced it. The photo of a certain spot in town, keep an eye out for it. It's near an ice sculpture. Okay. Go to the ice sculpture place. I can't believe... Oh, hold on. Uh, there's a dude wanting to find me. Okay. The ice sculptures are behind me. Alright. Excuse, 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 excuse. Okay, uh... The phone booth over there. It's either that one or... Excuse me. Well, let's do this to begin with. It's been a while. Yeah. People walking up the street. Oh, I can't cross here. Okay, it's this one. No? Apparently it's not this one. Oh wait, there's more phone boxes across the street. Which I can't get to from here. No, fight! Get out, get out, yep, yeah, no, fight. <laughs> there it is. This phone booth, that's the one in the photo. Guess I'm supposed to answer it. Hello? Go to the lottery kiosk. The passcode is seven scattered losing tickets. Seven scattered losing tickets. Seven scattered losing tickets. Six broken noses. Five Christmas trees. Four dickhead Yakuza. 
three punches to the head. <laughs> two bloody noses. And Tiger Saijima in a tree. I don't know. I can't get enough of the bike attack, it's so good. <laughs> Man, that snap. That's the sound of a, a broken spine. Nice try. Just leave me alone. This one. Oh my god, there's one on this side of the street as well. Go away! <laughs> Just want to get. Oh my god. Ah! There's even another one directly ahead. I guess. Ugh. Every three seconds. <laughs> I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> <laughs> it just walks me into the direction of these guys. <laughs> this is like a... If this was a different plot, this would be, you know... Saijima just trying to get home for Christmas. <laughs> I would watch a movie like that. I'm just... Pretty much everything that's happened so far, but the plot is instead of trying to figure out, well, what happened to Majima, it's like, no, he's just trying to get home for Christmas, and this is the shit he has to get through. So exhausted. <laughs> I'm so tired. Just let me cross the road. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I didn't need to cross the road. Hold on, photograph. Seven scattered losing tickets. Seven scattered losing tickets. I know what that means. From the Grand Casino Pass. May Lady Luck be with you. Appreciate it. Finally got the damn pass. Now back to ambitious. The save screen kills me every time. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave it here. I know it's kind of mid plot, but I just noticed the time. It's like 2 a.m. almost. So I need to get some rest because I got some stuff to do in the morning. But, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you're watching this later on YouTube as well, thanks for sticking around to the end and hope you have been enjoying the playthrough of this so far. We'll probably pick this up again tomorrow, so at some point. Uh, but in the meantime, if you are on YouTube and you want to support the channel, the easiest way to do so is just click buttons like the like button. It helps a lot. Thank you to those that do do that. I do appreciate it a lot. Or if you want to watch me play something else in the meantime that isn't fighting bears and um, just getting harassed in a city, you can click one of the videos that may have popped up on your screen by now. So hope you check them out. But yeah, we'll see you next time, YouTube.